Hey, hey, everybody, this is Larry. This is me going with Q3 of the weekly contest 286, Find Palindrome with Fixed Length. So this one is um, a kind of a tricky one, but not that bad once you realize the pattern. The pattern is that instead of finding the next palindrome or whatever, you basically recognize that a palindrome, half of it, you only care about half of it. And because there's no leading zeros, you just have to start with one zero 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 zero, and then... You, and then after that, you just count up. And that's basically the idea I have here is that, oh, I have so many spaces here. Um, basically for each query, I get the, the query. And if if it is not of length R, uh, or, or if the int length, then I just set it to negative one and then I return the int version of the answer here. Um, otherwise, this is how we get the, the Q number is that we look at half, um, for example, if, if you have length four, you only care about the first two digits. If you have length three, you care about only the first, you know, n minus two, something like that digits, right? So three, you care about the first two digits and so forth. And that's basically all the idea. So you have all this and then you minus one for this power of 10 thing um, because, yeah. Um, and then that's basically the idea. And you subtract one for the leading zero of one, zero, 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 zero. So for example, the first number is going to be, um, you know, one, let's say you have, this is only half the digits and so forth. And if you count from that, then the, the if you have odd number, you just have to refract it to create the other half. Uh, if it's even number, you just have to add one more number in the middle. And that's pretty much it. And that's basically the idea behind this. And yeah, um, this is going to... So this is obviously all over of one ish. I mean, sure, converting into strength is length uh, over of int length, and this is also concat. So, given uh, given a lot of queries in theory, that would be okay. But um, but yeah, that should be good. Um, yeah, that's pretty much all I have for this one. This is going to be. This is roughly speaking, all of one or all of. Um, w or let's say of L where L is the int length um, and this is obviously of Q because we get one number for each Q. Uh, that's all I pretty much have for this one. Let me know what you think. Stay good, stay healthy and oh wait, you could watch me sub live in the contest. Next. Smallest possible palindrome length. Oh, wait, what? Oh, for each query. Hmm. This is just annoying. It's not even hard, but int length. Hmm. hmm. Why is it not on one? Did I miss this one? Chris, oh, I misunderstood this problem actually. Okay, I misread this. I thought it said the next biggest one. Okay. Uh, uh, well, I guess I can still wait it this way, but. X minus one. X has to be small, and then it 
is just X. Okay, so if this is four, then it's two. If this is three, then you have one. Okay. Hmm. No, this is okay. Let's do this and then okay. Return this for now. How many crews are there? there. Oh, this one. Okay. Mm. Hmm. Three, four, two, ten, two, two is a hundred. Okay. Make them off by one. Yeah, definitely off by one. Um, Okay, so that looks good. I just have to do the other half. Okay. Um, This isn't too expensive. Yeah. I have to do the negative one. Um, hmm. Hmm. It's actually. Uh, some ridiculous number, but that's clearly wrong. Um, oh. Are we supposed to int or integer? I might have messed up. I'm, this might give me a wrong answer to be honest. I just I think I messed up here. Um, so that's actually fortunate that I caught that one maybe. Let's give it some bit. Hopefully this is right. Okay. Yeah, thanks for watching. Hit the like button, hit the subscribe button, join me on Discord. Let me know what you think about today's problem, this problem, whatever you like. I'll see you later. Stay good, stay healthy, to good mental health, and take care. Bye-bye.